see that the real Max is back. So, how was your time trip, dude? Shut up. Oh, you're alive. You're alive. Oh, both of us. I did so much to bring you back, Chloe. It worked. It actually worked. You're with me again. Looks like even fate doesn't want us apart. And traveled through multiple realities just to save my ungrateful ass over and over and I hope it was worth it. But I don't blame you for wanting me out of your life after all my drama. Come on. I'm the official drama king and queen of Arcadia Bay this week. Just look at what my powers have caused in just a short time. Nobody. You're a Max fucking call for the time warrior. Even if you weren't, you're kind and caring. Nobody could have a better best friend. Nobody. You didn't ask for any of this to happen, but it did. You need to accept how awesome you are. Maybe I willed it subconsciously or something. I always wanted my life to be special. An adventure. But not without you. And it, it didn't happen until I moved back here. So, without you, my powers wouldn't even exist. And for whatever scientific, mystical reason that we'll obviously never figure out, we were meant to be together at this exact moment in history. I have to think that Rachel was somewhere behind the scenes, fighting for justice. I'd like to think that too. We all owe Rachel Amber. Now tell me everything that happened. You you remember, right? Well, we we left the party and made sure Jefferson couldn't find us. For once, I was glad I lived in an actual fortress. Then the storm got hella crazy, and, and you said we would be safe at the lighthouse. Chloe, look. The storm is getting bigger now. It's coming closer. Oh, I, I can't even believe this is real. This is happening because of me. Stop it. This is stop beating yourself up, okay? We've both paid our dues already on it. God, look at that. Look at that monster. Who knows? This could be Rachel's revenge. Our revenge. The lighthouse is out of the way of the tornado. Come on! Chloe... I've got your back, Max. 